really the only place that the church is substantially growing. And I follow this individual on Twitter because he has a lot of interesting tweets about the church in Africa. And it's from Okpanachi Elva Sunday. And he has shared a couple of photos here, Bill, about, you know, the incredible growth that the church has in Africa. And you see these, in these pictures of those podcast listeners out there, um, a lot of handsome folks out there, children, families getting baptized together, maybe 20 or 30 uh, African saints getting baptized by mostly African missionaries. There's not a lot of uh, white folks who go to these African countries and are missionaries. They try to uh, service the African missions in-house. And it kind of got me thinking, you know, Bill, why don't we see a lot of pictures like this in the church news? Because I don't recall seeing pictures like this. And one would imagine that the church would want to celebrate what's happening in Africa, but you never get pictures like this from the church news. It is strange, isn't it, that the church doesn't want to celebrate that. But, you know, I, I think you and I have both heard numerous statements or comments uh, come out of the church over the last couple of decades where missionaries that have come back home report that uh, mission presidents have been urged to not send those missionaries into the poor neighborhoods, but really they're looking to baptize the wealthy and influential. And hence, I sort of wonder if they really don't want to celebrate the growth in countries that have a higher degree of poverty and really are looking for tithe payers at the end of the day.